Hello and welcome back to What Jack Has Made. Um, in the last video I showed you responsive units and in this episode I'm going to be showing you how to apply those units and the flexbox rules to CSS code to make an, a gallery responsive. So first of all we're going to look at the code and we've got images and a parent element flexbox container. So the images we're going to set a max width of 25%, so 25% of its parent element. Then we're going to add padding of 2.5% so it has a bit more room to breathe and now as you can see the images are displaying responsively if I resize the browser they resize with it now even though these images are being responsive we want them to align vertically as you can see the center of the vertical point of this image is not synced up to the same point of this image so they're centered at the bottom so to fix this we need to enable flexbox now our flexbox container is going to be displaying flex and then we're going to have align items to be center so that the images align in a center vertical point and then we're going to add flex wrap oh, flex wrap and then wrap so it just keeps them in order and if we refresh you can see the vertical point of the first image aligns with the second and third and all the images align center with one another. So that's the basics of Flexbox and making images responsive. In the next episode, I'm going to be going over media queries and how to make this display differently on different devices.